All right, we do apologize for that. Alan Ochanda will be giving us details of that report on our subsequent bulletins. Now, efforts to enhance educational facilities and infrastructure in schools across Belgut constituency funded by the Constituency Development Fund are now in full swing. Speaking in Chip Kutun Secondary School, where he presented a 2.8 million shillings check to facilitate the completion of a new classroom block Belgut Member of Parliament Nelson Koech unveiled an ambitious plan to allocate at least 100 million shillings to various schools within the constituency during the current fiscal year. Koech at the same time said that the tender for construction of the long-awaited Capsoit Sond Road has been awarded and a contractor is already mobilized at the site. The MP also told off a section of Kericho leaders focused on politics instead of development. The road has been a source of anguish for motorists and commuters in Kericho County. Hey. You can imagine in five years how much we will have done. So there's a lot of work that we are going to do. I know the challenge is that it's mentioned. Here, I'm just going to be in the principle. I have some, like the ones you say, of class. You, that one, again, you should look to the next side. You know, your chair is also a friend, and he was from the summer. So there are some of the things that we need to sort out. So we need to sort out the classrooms. It will be a balance. So we need to get the rights of the world. Infrastructure in this area was forgotten. Uhuru Kenyatta decided to abandon this area and made it almost a ghost village. Now, Kenya, Sasuku and Mabarabara, Siwacho, Nilipana, Mabarabara, So, governments, what we are not looking for people, we are looking for development. If you are looking for people, you are in the wrong place. Moving on to other news.